that because as soon as you do, you can start to accept that it's you're the piece of shit. My door. Hi guys and good morning and welcome back to my channel. For this week's video, I am going to be filming for you guys my updated room tour. I think the last time I did a room tour was I think a year ago or so and my room definitely looks a little bit different. The layout is still kind of the same, you know, furniture, bed, chair, <laughs> but as far as like the decor goes, there's definitely things like I have changed up and like incorporated now, so I even got a new record player, which I'm so excited to show you guys. <laughs> I have a curtain. We love a good curtain. <laughs> I actually really, really like my room. I feel like it definitely describes my personality and I love incorporating plants and my two big monster plants have not failed me yet. I am trying my best to be a good plant mom. I am watering my plants. As far as like the little other details that are not like thrifted items in my room, I will be of course linking any of these items below in the description box for you guys. So like I have like my bedding, my mirrors, all of that stuff. Stuff. So yeah, uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and dive into my updated room tour. I think I'm going to start off by showing you guys this little section of my room and yeah, let me um let's get let's get started. <laughs> so again, right when you walk in, this would be the first little area you guys will be seeing. So, we are starting off with this little section right here of my room. I have this Breakfast Club poster. I believe I picked this up from a local record shop near me. I also put right here like a wall hanger. I believe I got this from Target, but I just hung up my Trader Joe's bag. That's like my go-to bag I always use. And then down here we have one of my long boards right here all right and oh all right catch you later <laughs> okay so welcome to this little corner of my room right here is actually where i keep my long board normally but i did use it right now to roll you guys in <laughs> this board is made out of bamboo so it it's so freaking sick. I love using this board. I do have a lot of my skateboarding tools like the grip tape and all of that stuff. Normally right underneath my bed just so I can like loosen the chucks too and all of that stuff. Lee, I'm gonna go ahead and link my actual go-to board. I don't know if this board in particular is still available at the van store. I did pick this one up I think two years ago, but I will be linking down below another board of mine that you guys already kind of know which one it is. And that's my Pintel long board. They do have, overall have really sick boards on their website okay next up let me go ahead and show you guys my mirror <laughs> so here is just an overview of my main mirror I always get questions about where the heck I got this mirror from it is from Ikea again I will be linking that down below for you guys and then on this side of my room right here I actually stacked two of these wooden crates right here I turned this little section part of my room as my little vinyl collection so I have Mac Miller of course I have Wallows of course Logic Wallows again um, Troy Savon and then right here I actually do have two of these iron-on patches that my sister actually gave to me she went to the Yosemite last week and she was like Stephanie like this is totally you so you can put these on your backpack do you have one of my cassette tapes this one is logics and if you guys didn't know I'm a huge fan of his music and then right here I have two of my cassette tapes only one of them works this one I actually thrifted from the thrift store this one doesn't work but I don't want to I want to keep this for Forever. <laughs> but this one right here works and this is the Sony Walkman and I got it off of Etsy actually so if you're ever curious of maybe where to find these vintage antiques check Etsy or even offer up sometimes has it and then I also have like the headset for it and then I have like this counter right here that my sister used for my birthday and just says hello sunshine and it was from Target right below for the second one right here I just have two of my Polaroids and then some nail polishes over there and then I I have my fake plant that I picked up from Target. Just a picture of me and my cousins. And yeah, this is what I basically have in this little section. Moving our way back up, right on top of my mirror right here, I have picked up these three little postcards right here that I actually got from San Diego. This one just says, hello from sunny San Diego. I have this one that has like a little van on it. And then right here in this little corner of my mirror, I did add this little sticker. It says, I am loved, I am enough, and I am strong. And this one I did pick up from 
Etsy. And then last but not least to finish this whole little corner of my room, I have my big beautiful monster plant. Oh my gosh, this baby is growing. I love this plant. <laughs> These, I love having plants in my room. They make me so happy and I feel like it just brings the room to life so much. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and move on to this little whole side of my room. I guess we'll start off with the bookshelf. Yeah, so this bookshelf right here is super, super cool and I love it. Not only that, my dad was actually the one who was nicely enough to help me bring this project to life i told him that i really wanted a bookshelf so he was like all right let's see what we can do and i was actually gonna buy a whole like wood new shelf and my dad's like no we can like totally do like do it ourselves and i was like okay so he had some extra wood in the backyard and we painted it down sanded it and created this nice bookshelf so i have my books up there um, and I will show you guys more in detail right now. So again, these are all the beautiful books. I cannot wait to like fill this whole thing up with books. It's almost there. As far as like the little decor goes, this little one, I believe I also got that from Pipe Co, like the vase of it. And then this beautiful sunflower vase, I thrifted, I wanna say, maybe four years ago or three and it's still with me and i love this thing and then i of course did just recently add my diploma which oh my gosh i still can't believe that's there <laughs> and then of course we do have my closet itself i actually just did some reorganizing so it is pretty much clean right now not too shabby it's a little bit still the top needs a little bit of help but other than that yeah, I got my ukulele, my sewing machine, and all of that stuff, my backdrop paper. Okay, now moving on to my favorite corner spot of my whole entire room. It has to be this whole area right here. The chair right here, my tia actually handed it down to my sister, and then my sister handed it down to me. I don't recall exactly where she got it from, but... This is just a beautiful vintage chair throw pillow goes. I believe I got this one from, I think, maybe Marshalls or like TJ Maxx. And then as far as the dresser goes, I believe we got this from Ashley's Furnitures. Got a lot of these little trays right here from Target, actually. And they are so convenient to have. I have some of like my skincare stuff right here. Right here is just a diffuser. I love the smell of this one. This smells seriously so good. This is actually a recent find i went to the flea market and i found this beautiful vase and i was like i have to bring this home so the pattern of it is absolutely beautiful on this little area right here i have a bunch of like jewelry accessories and all of that stuff a little candle as well is from target right here this mirror i actually did pick this one up from target too picked up this beautiful record player and on top i do have my other plant right here let me just move this real quick this bad boy right here i actually thrifted from the thrift store and i love this one so freaking much i don't recall the brand name of it i've tried looking for it because normally it would say like the name right here but i thought it was the victoria or victorial one but it's i don't think it is and if it is cool i'm not too sure <laughs> you could put a cd in it and also has the radio oh oh Oh, oh, and then also does have an aux with it and as well as a cassette where you could play your vinyls and you could put your records. Okay, so this is the next little section part of my room. This is definitely the area that switched up quite a bit. I created this little desk area when I was doing my school stuff, but first we'll start off with this little wall right here. So I just printed these off of my printer and wanted to create a very simple like little collage wall. I have this one right here. This one just says the New Yorker. Wallows, of course. And then I picked up this little mirror right here from Urban Outfitters for, again, for this little area part of my room. I did get this hanging plant. This is actually a fake hanging plant. This one I got from Marshalls and it still has a sticker on it. This I got, I think, when I was like 15 years old. So it's been up there for a bit. <laughs> Both the shelf, the desk, and the chair are from Ikea. The desk is super convenient, I love it. It does come with a little bit of a drawer. I kinda wanna show you guys the drawer, but I'm kinda scared because it's super messy. <laughs> okay, but here is this little area right here a little bit closer up. So again, here is the desk. Here's the chair. I believe I even got the seat cushion from Ikea. And again, sorry, this is really messy, but. And then I have my laptop right here, my iPad, a picture of me and my best friend. This is actually supposed to go up right here, but it fell. And then, um, yeah, I just have some more 
Polaroid pictures of me and my best friend and my family. This is actually something my best friend gave me. She gave me like a whole packet of, of things to open when and then, yeah, so. And then I have some of my church stuff right here. This lamp right here I did pick up from Target. Right up here for this floating shelf area, I do have like this, have this pot right here that I got from Ikea. And then I have some of my books that I kind of need to start studying for, for the sea best and all of that stuff. Some of my books still from, from my child development classes. Then I have my little vlogging camera right here. A little plant that I picked up from Pipeco again. And it's just a little cactus one. And my two Bibles right here. This one was actually hand painted, which is so, so beautiful. I love this so much. And then it's front and back. And I also have this other one right here that I believe I got this one off of Amazon. Um, if you guys are curious to where I got this one, I'm gonna go ahead and link her Instagram down below. She does like hand painted Bibles and they're so beautiful. Cool, now moving on to this little portion of my room. We have my actual bed frame. This is also from Living Spaces. I don't know if I said Ashley's Furniture for my actual dresser or if, it's, if I mentioned Living Spaces. I got this bed frame when I was like 15 years old, so it's been quite a long time. Now, as far as the actual bedding it goes, I believe I picked it up from Urban Outfitters. It was on sale actually, and I have never ran to Urban Outfitters so fast. And I picked it up, and I think I got it for like 50 bucks when originally it's like, I think like 150. So it saved 100 bucks. I was like, heck yeah. This bedding in particular is not an actual quilt, it's more of like a duvet, a duvet, a duvet, duvet. It's more of a duvet, if anything. So here's just a close up of how the curtain rod, this is how the curtain looks too. It has like this really beautiful detail on it like this so I will be going ahead and linking the curtain rod and the curtain itself and then lastly we do have this little section part of my room and it just looks like this so again this is actually like a better look at the actual frame the bed frame itself right here at the top I did add this floating shelf this is also from Ikea I do have right here just some of my little like knickknacks and stuff. So I had this like yellow box that I thrifted from Savers and it just has a lot of like a lot of my school supplies in there. And I have this plant right here as well as, as well as another plant pot right there. And right underneath I have this photo collage wall that's been on my room since, oh my gosh, I think uh, over like, two years now but i really really like it so i actually took this picture myself i have the sandlot back to the future these really cool vintage cars my jesus sticker and yeah that is basically this little section part of my room <laughs> okay guys so that is basically my completed room tour there's always little things that change here and then but for the most part it stays the same old same old <laughs> yeah i hope you guys did enjoy this week's video if you guys did do not forget to give it a big schnigy and as always guys be your own kind of beautiful and spread peace, love, and positivity, and I will see you guys as beautiful as you can start to accept next week. You're the piece of shit. No, you. Yeah, running, running, got me gunning, gunning. I'm an old school cat, got me sunning, sunning. I'm funny how the rest, but I'm coming, coming. I'm funny how you back for the loving I've been.